It's the Daily Doug. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to the Daily Doug. Thanks for being with me today. My friends, I am pumped for this episode. I expect it to be deep. I expect it to be meaningful. I expect it to be visceral. We're going back to music by Ren, and we're going to be hearing Money Game Parts 1, 2, and 3, and I am happy that you are with me. So Ren, he's uh, a Welsh uh, songwriter, musician, producer, and rapper, and I think he's just brilliant. Uh, I was first introduced to his work in episode 548 here on The Daily Doug uh, with his incredible song uh, called High Ren. And what an introduction to him that was for me. I found his language to be absolutely profound. And his music, his music was a valuable vessel, a tool for him to deliver that profound language and performance that just cuts right through the BS. I find him to be a true artist. And I, I uh, was interested to keep following him. Next, I listened to Animal Flow. That was in episode 584. Most recently, I listened to his tragic tale of Jenny and Screech. That was in episode 616. And y'all, I just think he's a generational storyteller and artist. And uh, he seems to have a way of just reaching through whatever medium he's using and he has just grabbed hold of of my consciousness and kind of shaken me up a little bit and so i am eager to get to uh money game he has just this week released his second album called sick boy it's uh boy with b-o-i and this one includes Animal Flow, which I've heard, but it also includes Money Game Part 3, and that's where we're going. This is the culminating song to a three-song arc that began on Halloween night 2019 when the original uh, Money Game video was uploaded to YouTube. Uh, part 2, Money Game Part 2, followed on April 16th of 2020 and as i said just about a week ago money game part three was released on youtube and uh, you know of course i wasn't a aware uh, of ren until relatively recently so this gives me the opportunity to experience all three parts of this piece and take it all in at the same time and uh, I, i'm really really looking forward to it so what's he talking about well it's called money game Right, So I don't think it's too hard to infer his uh, point of view. I've briefly uh, read through the lyrics, so I have an idea, an inkling as to what he's saying here. And uh, as, as I read through the lyrics, it's fun to try to intone his uh, lyrics rhythmically, but uh, I know that he's a much better rapper than I am, y'all, so I'm going to leave the rapping to him. Uh, the song, I believe, in general, all three of these, are uh, commenting on uh, the uh, the ultra capitalistic culture of the world right now, with uh, rampant, visible corruption and hypocrisy, and how money itself can become uh, a weapon and wield it as a weapon time and time again. So I'm eager to get into all three of these. I'm going to start with uh, part one, and then I'm going to go right through part two, and then we're going to do part three. So come along for this uh, ride with me, y'all. I have not heard any of these before, and I'm going to attempt to keep up. So let's start with Money Game part one from Ren. Off we go. <laughs> Love how he does good acoustic stuff. It's a strange time we're living in. Walk and put fear in. Hierarchy parties, they make us feel inferior. Read one straight from oh. Parliament interiors. Devils walk among us, they fit the criteria. Every theory, strike fear in. We're weak minded men when we're clearly living in dictatorships. Nearly Minor blinded five. by illusions to choose. Who's fooling who? A ball chain to your shoes, I'm pain. It's a crying shame. The pursuit of our own wealth lies aflame and makes got greed. The game, the less this whole world burn. As the world turns, the whole world burns. As the world turns, the but whole world burns. Money was invented burns. to trade, but now those bits money was invented for trade. Twist hearts make slaves, turns a saint into a sinner, a child into a killer. His finger on the trigger of a money game. Wow. 
Okay. Uh, wow. But money was invented for trade, but now those bits of paper twist hearts make slaves, turns a saint into a sinner, a child into a killer, his finger on the trigger of a money game. He's, it's already brilliant, y'all. Uh, it, it's right. I agree with it. Uh, let's see how he uh, keeps going. Off we go. Oh, rain, 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 rain. rain, rain. A storm it comes our way. And those who rise through distorted lines. Poison in the veins. But we like to put the blame, 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 blame. It's easy as to blame. But point the mirror at the that mirror side. ourselves. We're all part We're of all this part of old it. money game. Stop. You can hear the real sounds. They're really doing this. Live, y'all. Presented visually, Mr. President, are just, just as profound as the president's fear when they support these ideas to keep us separate. When they make us believe that everybody is coming to terrorize you in the streets, they say, at least the grit of teeth, that's my right to hate. That's freedom of speech. But when did freedom become a reason to hate, a way to justify a racist slur or insult we make? There's an irony in freedom, cause us in the West, we have pillaged and plundered the murder that savages call on that sort of the rest. That's called hypocrisy. Preach a certain value that you never keep yourself. Your country was in flames, you denigrate yourselves in a second. Still, you spit your venom, demonizing immigrants when really you're the immigrant, cause all of us are immigrants or descended from immigrants. Irony is imminent. I'll shed the light on immigrants. America was colonized by Britain. Britain. Britain, it was colonized by Rome, Rome. and also colonized by the Saxons. Saxons. They were German, by the way. You know how people throw shade upon the Germans because of history's pain, and yet we made the same mistakes all the game. Demonize the whole people, it's Jewish and Muslim, true, the same and the same. Old situations play on repeat. The yep. same old TV shows same repeat. Yeah, we worship the bleak. Our opinions aren't our own, and we follow like sheep. There's, there's no, no left, left, there's no right, right in the middle, we sleep. Rain, 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 rain. All the low octave is an awesome choice. Play. And those who rise through distorted lives Poison in the veins But we'd like to point the blame, 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 blame It's easier to blame But point the mirror at ourselves We're all part of this old money game Okay We're all part of it, y'all What's he gonna do? Huh. Sacrifice a player to the game. This money God, game. Mm -hmm. Humming the tune as you do it. Nothing to see here, folks. This old money game. New player. Because they're indisposable. I think is what he's going for here. Shit. All without a cut, right? With the silences. Is he gonna light himself on fire? For the poise he has to just take his time. part of the game. No, 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 no. 
nennen. Speechless, y'all. Holy crap. If that's how it starts, he ain't playing. He is not messing around. And I applaud him. Holy crap. The chorus, rain, rain, rain. A storm, it comes our way. And those who rise through distorted lies poison in the veins. But we like to point the blame, 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 blame. It's easier to blame, but point the mirror at ourselves. We're all part of this old money game. That was brilliant. And I want to keep going. I want to keep going while my, my brain's kind of scrambled and just see what else he has to say. So I'm going to go on to money game part two and no telling what's going to happen y'all we're down the rabbit hole now so let's do it part two off we go um, same key and this looks like a lyric video dum, dum. strange time we're living in panic and hysteria Upon starts the same way strange times, times we're living in narcissist mindset spread like malaria sit back and watch the show Cool. Split through fickle shit. A government so he adds a little bit, right? Crits. These counters the fit. Politicians sit in parliament. Not adequate. Come on. Needlessly bleeding resources all dry. Turn a blind eye if it means a pay rise. Oh, what a shame it would be. I would die. If number 10 Downing Street burned in a fire. Okay. Only joking, only messing. Don't be stressing. I'm a peaceful adolescent. There's no need to be unpleasant. Write my thesis in a rhyme scheme to analyze the brain while my finger's on the trigger of a money game. Oh. Rain, 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 rain. Yep. A storm it comes up way. <laughs> and no so he's got the same chorus. Lies, poison in the face. But we die upon the play, 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 play. It's easier easy to play. Good point that works. It's right already in my head. We're all part of this whole money game. There was some footage of the original video in there. But most of this is just stock footage of politicians and experts. Money is a game and the ladder we climb Turns a saint into a sinner with his finger in crime I'll break it down for you motherfuckers line by line This is business economics in the nursery rhyme She sells seashells on a seashore But the value of these shells will fall Due to the laws of supply and demand No one wants to buy shells Cause there's loads on the sand Step one, must create a sense of scarcity Shells will sell much better if the people think they're rare You see, bear with me Take as many shells as you can find And hide them on an island Stockpile them high until they're rarer than a diamond Step two, if people think that they want them, really want them, really fucking want them, hit them like Bronson. Influencers, product placement, featured primetime entertainment. If you haven't got a show, then you're just a fucking waste, man. Free. It's Monopoly. Invest inside some property. Start Get your iPad and an iPod here. Properly. Shells must sell. That will be your new philosophy. Swallow all your morals. They're a poor man's quality. Four. Expand, right expand, right expand. Clear forest, make land. Fresh blood on hands. Five. Why just shells? Why limit yourself? She sells seashells. Sell oil as well. Six on sell stock. Sell Sell diamonds, sell rock, sell water to a fish, sell the time to a clock, seven. Press on the gas, take your foot off the brakes, then run to be the president of the United States. Eight, big smile, make big wave, that's great. Now the truth is overrated, tell lies out the gate. Nine, polarize the people, controversy is the game. It don't matter if they hate you, if they all say your name. Ten, the world is yours. Step out on the stage to a round of applause. You're a liar, cheat, a devil. A whore, a new cell I love how they've the got seashore. the Wolf of Wall rain, Street in rain, there. Rain, rain, Scenes from that movie. Storm, it comes up way. Wow. And those who pass to also the shows poison in the face. But we die to the play, 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 play. How history it's just keeps repeating itself. We're all part of this We're old part money of this game. Old money game. Mm -hmm. There's even Scrooge McDuck. Mm -hmm. Y'all. It's groovy music too. Simple stuff, but it's so rhythmic and it's 
still in C minor. It gives him, like I said in the intro, a vehicle for all of these ideas to flow from his mind to ours. And it gives us a way to interact with it that isn't overwhelming. And it goes right to us. That's the power of music like this. Um, man, man, oh man. Uh, one of the thoughts that I had as, as they start talking about, you know, selling everything, man, is, is Amazon. We're Amazon customers. And it's something that I don't necessarily like, but it's, they make it so damn convenient. Um, I needed a, a new uh, cable for my computer the other day, and I went on Amazon in the morning, and I typed it in. I hit buy now. It was to my house uh, that afternoon. You know, I didn't have to go anywhere. Now, I mean, they sell everything, and they undercut and, and monopolize um, trade, and it's not good, but... It makes it easy to buy. So how do we get out of that? <sighs> Still just looking at his at his lyrics here. Um, this is going to take more than a one time listen for me to really, really um, internalize all the points that he's talking about. But for now, I, I, I get it, and I want to keep moving on because uh, Money Game Part 3 is the new one, and it's one that he has, uh, by his uh, own words, taken a lot of time and a lot of care. And he says it's one of his uh, better uh, pieces of work. And so it really makes me uh, eager to see how this finishes up and what he's going to say next. This is longer than the other ones. So let's dive in. Money Game Part 3 uh, just released about a week ago. Let's see what Ren uh, has for us this time. Off we go. Piano. Ha! <laughs> ha! Little takeoff on Grieg. So that's A minor. Nice. Is that him playing? There's the five. Shit. Okay. Over an A chord. Same thing over an F. Who's the other? ourselves, right? Again, the silence and the time. The reveal was him. Three years old, walking quickly. Four years old, he was running round the pavements of his city. So it's Five a years old, and his daddy wow. told him, "Listen here, son, you gotta learn to be a man." 
A man he works for what he wants Six years old and he's reading One, writing Top of the six, bunch And when he's seven His regression made him student number five, one Eight seven, years old one, and he's praised for unusual grades Nine, his parents paid for private school to nurture the flame Ten, school. eleven, twelve, thirteen He ascends and ascends His daddy tells him, son Money is the means to all ends Money is 14, the means to all ends mathematic equations At fifteen, IQ a hundred and fifty Still eligible so he's Sixteen, he very develops smart. complex software code that detects weaknesses in cybersecurity protocols. Seventeen, and he sells his vision, keeping the share. Not yet an adult, but he's practically a millionaire. He's a millionaire. Eighteen, and his daddy tells him, "Now you're a man. This world don't give a damn about you, so take all that you take can." You can. Nineteen, he turns a profit, stocks and shares, invest in product. Twenty, double down deposits. Twenty-one, his income rockets. Twenty-two, he learns the truth is just Great. an. Playing, by the way. If you manipulate the data, then the lie will sell itself. 23, a life of luxury, crystal and cocaine. 24, Stop. he makes the Forbes list, they're applauding his name. 25, and his daddy tells him, listen here, son. While you're sitting in that palace, that don't mean that you won. Boy, his 26, dad has the wrong idea. He switches business to arms. He's 27, dealing nuclear and shells in Iran. Jesus. 28, inside the Senate, money bought him a seat. He's 29, a role of counsel in the president. Sweet. Now he's 30. His daddy says you're losing the race. You're just a servant to the king, not even in second place. 31, a big maneuver for his daddy's, for his approval. daddy's approval. Moving imports over borders from the exports out of Cuba. 32, moving grams, growing kilos to tons. He's Drug 33, filling drugs. warehouses with powder and guns. Wow. 34, turf war with nobody to stop it. Blind eye from the popo inside of his pocket. This is amazing. 35, he gets the call. I'm sorry, son, but it's your father. Had a heart attack. Gone. I'm sorry, he's Body. gone. 36, getting pissed off, abusing his product. His dad dies. 37, eyes glazed, disposition demonic. 38, with a prostitute, a moment of passion. Heating up a silver spoon and then chasing the dragon. 39, getting breathless and hungry for power. Mm -hmm. yep. Daddy's words are still driving him to kill and devour. Makes a move against the cartel, but the strategy's flawed. They retaliate and leave him in a hospital ward A bullet buried in his vertebra And one in his leg The doctor sighs and says I don't think you'll be walking again So he loses the ability to walk And there's his wheelchair This is all in one take, y'all Another tragedy We got Let me tell you a story about a boy named Jimmy. He was 40, and he cursed the words, mine, mine, gimme. Wow. 41, he wasn't now walking. He's got a string quartet 42, back not walking quickly. 43, never running round the pavements of the city. 44, inside a palace inside with a mountain palace, of gold. But of those gold. riches turn to rubble when perspective evolves. Weighing heavy on his conscience is the value of gold. Lamborghini for a life, trading money for trading souls. Money for Jimmy souls. followed the code inside the amazing. land of the free. Put your hand inside the cookie jar, take more than you need. And his example is exaggerated versions of me. And it's a version, it's of, a version him. of him. And it's a version of it's she. A version of and she. it's a version of you. you. There's no escape. Escaping the blame, the way we live is parasitic. Fuck the money and fame. Call the music. This isn't entertainment. This is real life. The way we live is lunacy. Community it declines. Hyperpolarized, always fighting, then we divide. Truth is less important than the money that we designed. Mm. Money's an invention. Politics from our invention. They all come from people's ideas. Did I mention? Borders an invention. Law and order fuel the tension. It leads to people killing each other. My solution. <clears throat> What's he gonna do? 
my solution? Question mark. I'm no gun expert, but that looks real, y'all. Everything is subject to change. We could build utopias if individuals were taught to use their brains. But if we teach kids in schools to always be sheep and put themselves before the herd, if there's more money for me, then there's no future I see where the humans survive with parasites inside He's got a, a loaded dish gun. with cannibal minds. Mold will grow upon the surface and consumes till it dies. And our fate could be the same without this story to the wise. It's insane, y'all. Forty-five. Jimmy comes home out of the rain, soaking wet upon a wheelchair, drinking the game. He is everything he wants, he is fortune and fame. He's a fortunate fool with an unfortunate fate. With a 45 caliber aimed at his brain. 45 a fitting number, cause his age is the same. Here's the words of his father. It's such a damn it's shame. Such a damn shame. Then he presses on the trigger of a money game. No. <clears throat> How am I supposed to say anything coherent about that? My goodness. I hate guns, y'all. I hate violence. I have fleed from them my entire life. I don't watch horror movies. It just makes me uncomfortable, viscerally uncomfortable. I can't but mm. <clears throat> the sound of the gun clicking after like a split second after the uh, the screen goes dark. Here's a guy named Jimmy. Let's go through Jimmy's life. Oh my goodness, y'all. He's born to what I assume is a well-to-do family. Um, he was selfish. His first words were, my mind, give me. Um, he's smart. His parents <clears throat> had the um, means to put him in an elevated um, school, a private school. And his dad tells him, son, money is the means to all ends. And he's got an IQ of 150 and just conquers the world seeking his father's approval and it was never enough uh, after he makes the Forbes list there's applauding uh, and his daddy tells him listen here son while you are sitting in your palace that don't mean that you won when he's 30 his daddy tells him you're losing the race you're just a servant to the king not even in second place it was uh, yeah And then his dad dies, and he never gets the chance to feel and achieve knowing that his dad was proud of him. I don't know, y'all. This is absolutely incredible. And then, okay, verse 3. This ain't entertainment. This is real life. The way we live is lunacy. Community, it declines. We're hyper-polarized, we're always fighting, and we divide. Truth is less important than the money that we design. No shit, y'all. I don't want to say, you know, the world is crazy right now. Um, my specialty, above all else, music or otherwise, is analysis. It's... It's looking at all of these parts and trying to put them together and see if I can find meaning. It's how I approach 
uh, my own compositions. I start with an overall plan and then try to build top down from there until we get at the surface level. And then all of those things can relate back, right? So that it's, it's part of the training. But analyzing music, analyzing complex systems, that's part of what drives my brain and my own curiosity. And I have my own thoughts about culture, about life, about society, about hypocrisy and corruption and all that sort of stuff. And I agree. I don't see anything in any of this that I disagree with from Ren. Um, it's a powerful, powerful statement. You know, what remind, uh, one thing comes to mind, uh, one of the shows that I absolutely loved as a kid was Star Trek. I'm young enough that for me it was Star Trek The Next Generation. I uh, you know, went through all of high school and college on that show. And one of the things that I always found um, freeing about seeing a society like that was the lack of money. The lack of it. If we have uh, the galaxy at our fingertips, why do we need to fight over money? You know, let's do it together. Um, it's one of the reasons why I love choir so much. When we're singing together, we're not fighting. We're breathing together. We're trying to lift up everybody else. We are our own person, but we're also part of a team. It's why team sports is great. Um, and it teaches us how to manage our individuality with our connection to our neighbors. And money gets in the way of that, it separates us. And, um, you know, we, we've done okay with money. It's been a struggle at times. We're both artists. Uh, we've relied on the help of family and, and friends at times uh, with the uh, the YouTube channel going. We're doing okay, but we, it's it's not a ton. And we have enough to be uh, uh, safe and uh, to have what we need and to be able to, to uh, give back and be a part of our community. We don't have so much that it becomes uh, an overall driver of our uh, everyday life to keep having that amount of money, you know? I don't know what it's like to be really, really rich and have, and, and what to do with it all. I don't know. But what I do know is that making money into almost like a godlike obsession will cause pain. It will cause just carnage in your personal life, in your family life, even in your um, even in your professional life. It may feed you for a while, but over time, it's just money. It in its importance is single. It's, it's solitary and it doesn't, it doesn't feed all of those other needs for a fulfilling life, I think. And um, I just continue to be so impressed with Ren. Um, how did he do that? How did he do that? I don't, I don't know, y'all. I'm rambling because I, my, my mind has been left on the floor. I'm I'm, I'm overwhelmed with this piece of art. And, uh, I'm just happy to have it filmed. I'll look back on it and say, yeah, that's what I felt like. <laughs> uh, it's amazing. It's absolutely incredible. Friends, listen to this man, listen to Ren, listen to his music, empathize with him. Um, and heed his words. I think they're profound. I think they're intelligent. And I think they come from a mind that is known pain, that is known brokenness, and that has um, been through it. And he's not only just lifting up a mirror to society, he's warning us. 
and saying, this is what we're doing. And it's lunacy, y'all. There's no reason to continue living like this. We can change it. And if enough people believe that we can change it, we will. We will. And I think goodness and the lack of hypocrisy and a, and a lessening of corruption and all that will prevail. Because I believe most of us believe in the power of, of being interconnected, that even though we're special and we are individually important, uh, a lot of that, con our connection and our meaning in our life is our relationships. And, and to always keep that as an integral part of your life story and to um, uphold and feed those relationships as much as you feed uh, and work on your craft and your, um, your career and your wealth management, you know? Um, absolutely, <sighs> absolutely incredible. Money Game, parts one, two, and three. Uh, I will be sharing this with any person in my personal life that I can find and say, you got to listen to this. And so I thank you for hanging out with me and experiencing it with me. And uh, I, I couldn't be uh, just more gobsmacked by it, y'all. I, uh, I am in awe of his artistry and his language and his ability to communicate it. So um, until next time with Ren because I will be back to more of his music. I, I thank you for being with me and for the support. And uh, I hope that that came off as authentic because I don't know how else to be, y'all. Uh, amazing, amazing, amazing. Whew. Okay, uh, I believe that is all for today. I thank you for being with me and we will see you next time on another edition of The Daily Doug.